Good morning. Uh, we are now completely stocked for our Babs trunk show. Let's see, let's start with the kits. So we have a table full of kits. This is the Terra Mares shawl, and we have a lot of kits for that. We also have kits for the Spice Market shawl, which I know has been around for a while, but it's so pretty. And uh, she did send us a few kits for that, but we can certainly make, whoop, very sunny this morning. We can certainly make our own kits up for you, but there's quite a selection of kits to do lots of good, fun um, things. These are the kits for the Sharon Show. And let's see, this one is, well, it's a Yasmini six color set. I have to figure out what that one's for, but it sure is pretty. Lots of beautiful colors. Uh, we have put out the new Rowan book, the new Strands of Joy, Barbara's Mosaic Lace. I'll be putting out a bunch of other books today. This is um, Big Silk, which is one of my very favorite worsted weight yarns. Um, we do have two awesome samples in that. And this is Casa Pinkas Powder Wrap um, in Big Silk. It takes two skeins. This is actually the color of the sample. Isn't it pretty? Of course, everything Babs does is pretty. So, um, and this one is really pretty too. This one takes one skein. I like the little detail in it. It's called uh, Scattered Rose Hips because look, little scattered rose petal leaves. Okay, let's move on. So now we're gonna go to a table full of Miss Babs Toes. If any of you are familiar with her, you know these are the mini skeins of Yummy Two Ply. She sent this beautiful, beautiful little, uh, like a bandana cowl. It's called Floral Fade. It takes um, three toes gradient. She sent me um, the colors to make the actual one on display. But again, we can create our own fades. Um, this very long double-sided table is yummy two-ply all the way down i'll tell you when it stops but in the middle is we're so excited all this moon glow so you can hold it with it to create a nice fuzzy light shawl you can hold it separate this one for example is one skein of moon glow it's called my softer side um, they have put a few little sparkly stones or beads in it it's really pretty um, there's some mosaic shawls that are barber's patterns that are here. There's uh, a lot of things you can do, but this is, um, this is more yummy to ply, I think, than you'll ever see in any one place. It's just, here's like a long table look of yummy to ply. And then I think we go to yummy three ply, which if you're not familiar with it, it's a sport yarn. It's nice and springy. It's really pretty. It's a great sport yarn. Um, it's hard to find sometimes really nice sport yarn, especially um, in variegated sometimes, but we have a good selection of that. And then um, our favorites, Yowza Minis. It's great for color work for a sweater using one or two skeins of Yowza for the background. And then you can use the Yowza Minis for the color works. Um, she's had these a couple years before you used to have to get an entire skein of Yowza for color work, but I'll give you a quick glimpse of the Yowza. She did send us this sweater, which is really pretty in Yowza and Yowza minis, but there's a ton of Yowza sweater quantities of all of it. Um, this shawl is called, um, Ulta Flex. It's very cool little pattern design on it too. And it only takes one Yowza. There's so many patterns out there for one skein of Yowza. Um, it's just a perfect, perfectly sized skein. Here's some more colors. It goes um, all the way around and more Yowza. 
Uh, it's a great weight. It's um, She used to call it a light worsted. And now it's called a DK, but I have used it as a worsted. In fact, um, in my Tecumseh I made, which calls for a worsted, it's all Yowza. Um, and it was before Yowza Mini, so I had a lot of yarn left over to do other fun things. But that's how it works up. We also have Cat's Reed Cardigan, which is so extremely popular. Um, they can be done out of Yowza. Uh, we've had a couple of our staff do it out of Yowza, a couple customers. It's a great, um, very versatile yarn to do very many things. I have had um, people make baby blankets out of it. I've had, it, you can just use it for just about anything. So um, again, if you're around, stop by. It starts tomorrow. Um, we also have a few of Hohe's bags left that I've put out here. That's all we got left. So um, only one of the extra large hobo bags and it's in the green olive suede. Um, other than that, they're all the small bags. Um, there's a few available, but um, stop in starting tomorrow. You don't need an appointment tomorrow, but you might have to wait a little bit and uh, it should be a lot of fun. Wait, there's more. I have to show you some of these other samples, but it's kind of like a maze. I hope I'm not walking too fast. I'll slow down because uh, there's just too, too much to look at. So let's look at these samples over here. This is also Catherine's um, Kitty B pattern. It's the Wilson Ruana and it's made with, um, let me back up, one skein of Katahdin, and the color is Deep Sea Jellyfish, and we also have that available. And then there's, this is a, um, one of Barbara's patterns, and it is, well, it's not on here very well. Let's see. I think she wants it this way. Yep. This is called Headless Roses. Um, it's also very pretty. One skein of Katahdin. Katahdin, which um, is over here is also a great giant skein of yarn because it only takes one to create a very large knitted piece. And bonus, no ends to weave in. This is the Deep Sea Jellyfish. Um, there's a lot of other colors of Katahdin that you can use for many, many things. Um, I have used it. I'm almost finished with um, a pattern called Via Hante. And it's a great piece also, but I'll just slowly go over some of the other samples that are here. Like I said, if you're local, you really should come in and see it. Starts tomorrow. We're open extra hours tomorrow from 10 to 4. Um, we are limiting the number of people in the store, but um, if you bring some knitting, it'll be a beautiful day to sit outside and knit. We always have a group out there anyways. I love this one, Refract Refracted Twilight. It's beautiful. This one is Casapinka, The Sharon Show, which I'm pretty sure we have kits for over there. And then um, this, I, you, if you know me at all, you know I love color work. So this one's called Berries, Leaves, and Vines. And how fun is this one? Secret Handshake, Casa Pinka. So she's a star today here. Um, we also have a selection of woven scarves. They're a little hard to see in the sun there. That's a little better. Um, Jennifer, who usually comes, who we miss dearly, has begun or has been for a while, but now is a, an amazing weaver. And she uses, let's see what she used for these. Uh, Yaza. For these but i think you can use just about anything and how pretty is this you have weddings this summer um anything that you want to just dress up this is called of course long distance love it's beautiful and it takes two skeins of moon glow it's just beautiful so in a few more over here um this is one of my favorites of course you know me i like them all this is called b loved you like the honeycomb pattern in the top so 
that's a pretty good tour of what's here. Like I said, it's open to the public tomorrow, starting from 10 to 4. And then we have it all week, um, our normal hours during the week, 11 to 3. And then again next Saturday. So if you can't make it in this Saturday, come on in next Saturday uh, if you work during the week or if you're coming from afar. Um, from Monday through Friday to guarantee a spot, you can call um, or go online and make an appointment to guarantee some shopping time. So we hope we'll see you. There's a lot of fun things, a lot of great colors. Um, go look through your patterns, find some new ones, something that you've always been thinking about making. And come on in, get ready to pick out some beautiful yarn and we'll be happy to help you.